Hey guys, welcome to the seventh and final video in Unit 5, Video 4 series. This is Video G, Finding Tip and Sales Tax. So tip is something you give when you go out to dinner um, and you want to give your waiter or waitress a tip. Um, that's money that goes directly to the waiter or waitress. And sales tax, unfortunately, is something you have to pay on almost every single thing that you buy. Um, so here is an example. So Mary was out shopping and spent $125. The sales tax is 10%. What is her total? So what do we know? We don't know the part. Um, we know that she has to pay 10% sales tax on her total of 125%. So what A is going to represent is the amount of sales tax that we need to add on. So what we're going to do here is take our formula, A equals P times W, and substitute A equals 0.10 times 125. Um, sorry. And that means A is equal to, if you put this into your calculator and multiply, we get 12.5, which is the same as $12.50. So to find, and that's the tip. The tip is $12.50. Where's the sales tax? Yeah, sales tax. So the tax that you'll pay is an extra $12.50. To find her total balance, what we're going to do is take 125 and add 12.50 to this. So we get 50 cents, 137.50. So her total balance is $137.50. So this is method one. In method two, let's take a look at this scenario. In method two, we know that you have to pay the $125. Um, this is a rate of 100%. We also know um, that we want to pay that extra 10% because that's the tax that we have to pay. So we not only pay the 100% for 125, but we also pay that 10% more. So we're really paying 110%. So we start with our formula, A equals P times W. And then substitute in A equals our percent. We're going to do 1.10 or 1.1 times 125. And we get an answer of 137.50 or $137.50. So this is the total, including um, what we spent plus the 10% sales tax. So that's our overall final cost that we have to pay. Okay, so method one and method two. All right, example two, tip. This is a percent of money added to the total amount. So for example, for dinner, the Smith family's total came out to $45. They want to leave a 20% tip. What is the total amount they will need to pay? So let's write down what we know. We know that the percent is 20%. We know the whole bill was $45. So we want to know how much our tip's going to be. So here's method one. Um, A equals P times W. A equals our 20% so 0.20 times 45. So if you put that into your calculator, you get A equals 9. So remember the total The total equals the amount plus the tip. So what we're going to do is take our amount of $45 and add 9 to it. So 45 plus 9 is $54. Okay, and method 2 All right, sorry about that. In method 2 uh, we know that we need to pay $45. 
So this balance represents 100%. So when you go to a restaurant or a diner or a deli, whatever the total is, you can't negotiate and say, I'm only going to pay $30 or $15 or if it's $45, you have to pay $45. Um, so that in um, percentage representation, it's 100% of the rate. Um, you also want to pay your waiter or waitress 20%. So you not only pay your 100%, which is the $45, but you want to add 20% to it. So essentially, you're paying 120% or a rate of 1.2. So we're going to do A equals P times W. A equals 1.2 for P times 45 for W. So A equals $54. And this represents um, the amount that you pay, including the tip that you want to leave. So this is officially the end of the seven-part series. Thanks for watching. Please bring all your notes and questions to class tomorrow.